Hey everyone, Brian here with Audio Plugin Deals. Today we're going to have a quick look at Kinetic Woodwinds, the motion engine from Kirk Hunter Studios. If you guys know the Kinetic Brass and Kinetic Strings, we've covered already, so now we're going to check out the Woodwinds. So before we get started checking this one out, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and of course hit that bell notification icon so you know when we go live with videos and great deals just like this. All right, so like I mentioned, we're gonna check out Kinetic Woodwinds. If you guys are familiar with the other Kinetic libraries, these are all for contact full, and they take samples and you can create motions and rhythms and ostinatos with them. So we have a few different instruments over here. We have the bassoons, clarinets, flutes, and oboes, and then what I'm using is the Kinetic Woodwinds, which is all of these in one. We also have a low RAM option if you are in limited uh, resources or CPU RAM for your computer. So let's go in and check some of these out. Now we do have presets to kind of get you started, but you can load in different presets for each of the instruments. So you can load something unique for the flutes, oboes, clarinets, and bassoons, and so on and so forth. Or you can program in your own patterns into the engine. So let's check out some of the sounds here. Thank you. 
All right, so I just wanted to kind of do a quick look at that. There are more in-depth videos on this library, but at least you guys can hear what the samples sound like. Um, you can turn off the motion engine at any time just by clicking this and then playing just the multi samples themselves, which sound great. Also remember, you can load up the individual sections, bassoons, clarinets, flutes, and oboes as well, instead of having them all in this all-in-one. So we heard some of the presets, but again, you can go in and kind of customize those and program your own rhythms, or you can, for instance, have the bassoons playing a low riff or rhythm and then leaving the flutes and clarinets without the motion engine so that you can just kind of play those in as the multi-samples and do a little bit more of a live improvisation with that. Um, as I was playing some of those presets, some of them I didn't quite get perfectly in sync. So that is also something that is user error, not with the library. Um, so thank you guys for checking this one out with me. Just a quick look at Kinetic Woodwinds Motion Engine from Kirk Hunter Studios. Thanks again, and I will see you next time.